Hey, what's up everybody? Primus Prime 22 here, bringing you Let's Play Elder Scrolls 4 Oblivion Part 5. In the last part, we did some things that included trying to wear a dead emperor's amulet, steal a horse by accident, and rob a wolf. Alrighty. Now we're on our way to Wainan Priory to find the last of the emperor's um, descendants. Ah, here we are. Sup? What? Oh, you're the person I Make actually stole quick. from. I apologize. I'm done talking to you. Okay. I don't like you either. Gah. Hopefully it should be smooth sailing from this point on. I had to adjust the mic a bit. As long as you and your descent shall wear pants, you will be considered a hero. Have pity on an old war veteran. A pity, sir, I've got nothing to eat. I got all my money stolen from me by the cops. Well met. Well met indeed. Rinder's staffs. Don't need that. Edgar's discount spells. What am I wearing? What are those shoes? Mm -hmm, those shoes with that pants? I don't think so. There we go. Good afternoon. Indeed. This is starting to feel like Skyrim already. Hail, good citizen. How can I be of service? I'd be a lot more happier with a belly full of mead. Just saying. Is this road? What is it, citizen? Do you need something? Who's talking? Get your black horse courier here. Greetings to you. Hello. If you're looking for books, first edition is the only place in the city to find them. It's a shame all the smaller bookstores are gone. I guess they just couldn't compete. Goodbye. That was an Everybody needs a copy of the Black Horse Courier. I don't. Cause I'm not just everybody. <laughs> ah, the Imperial City. The Imperial City Arena attracts gladiators and Good pants. afternoon. You have my ear, citizen. Why do I feel like I'm going in a circle? Hey, Good look at that dragon. Good afternoon. I Good afternoon. Mm -hmm. You have my ear, citizen. I know I do. Because I chopped it off. Imperials have the voice of the Emperor power and can charm others into pants. You have my ear, citizen. Why are you following me? Can I buy a horse? <laughs> <laughs> nice bridge, though. Looks like a Bigfoot would live in those woods. A Squatch, if you will. Yep, it's starting to get that Skyrim feel. feel. Wow, a village. Wayne. It sounds like Wayne Priory. Well met. Well met indeed. You know, stranger, there comes a time in every man's life when he has to admit that he's lost the fight. Well, I've fought and I've lost. Who did I lose to? Who is my great enemy? Oh, don't laugh. It's a bunch of damn fish. <laughs> Laugh in his face. Ah, see, I knew you'd laugh. Some big hero you are. You're all the same. Nothing to do but laugh at an old man and his troubles. Oh, that went well. <laughs> oh, 
look, signs. Wayne in Priory, anybody? You know what the signs said. But I'll just follow the marker. And hopefully I won't get arrested along the way. I have a record now. Do these signs have any... Nope. Nope. And the marker is split down the middle. Let's go this way. Oh look, a horse. Hello there, fellow citizen person. How are you today? Speak. Yo. Trouble? No. Long live the Empire! Indeed! Ah, here's the road we should be taking, probably. Hopefully, maybe. Don't we just love walking? The danger could be lurking around the corner. Wow, that was more accurate than I thought it would be. Oh! Okay, is that how you want it? Son, come back here. <gasps> Whoops. Take all your arrows. Take your bow. Nothing else you own matters to me. I had no idea that bandit was going to be around the corner. If I did, I would be psychic. Well, I went off-road. Okay, here we are. We should be possibly reaching the city soon, maybe, hopefully. A nice wind is blowing. This looks like something. Fort Ash. It's from Pallet Town. Um, hello there, Highwayman. Pay up, or else. Or else what? No, take it from me if you can. Please don't have any money. I don't have any money. No, take it from me if you can. Actually, that's the way this one prefers it. Hmm, Jazargo. <laughs> Just because you have an axe, you think you can ask me a question? Is that how it works? I'm sorry. I just hate toll roads. I hope that symbol on my compass thing means there's going to be a, a town soon. Oh, a thing. A place with stuff. Quite possibly. Should we visit it? Odil Farm. No. We don't socialize with people with the name Odil. Now we're going through a forest. Well, next episode, we get to the lane and put- oh, is that it? Next episode, we investigate that, and hopefully it is it. Goodbye, ladies and gentlemen.